they desperately reach out. Now they realize your value. That person who thought you were not good enough, that person who chose somebody else and not you, the somebody else they chose treated them like a nobody. The somebody else they chose didn't appreciate them. They didn't have the eyes or the lens to see how great you are. They treated you with contempt. But the day comes when they realize that they made the biggest mistake of their life. They realize that greatness was in their presence all along. They realize that you are amazing, royal, the chosen one, blessed by the Almighty, gifted, super talented, pretty or handsome. They realize what they are missing. They chose somebody else, not you. And that day comes when they realize how wrong they were about you. You who had been good to them, you who had given to them, you who would have given even more to them. They walked away from you. They didn't give you that love. They didn't give to you what you gave to them, that kindness, that loving kindness. The day comes when they are desperate and you get that call. You get that call. They didn't see your value before, but now they see your worth. And I don't care if it's a romantic relationship or a friendship. A lot of people are treating you as if you're ordinary. Meanwhile, you are extraordinary. A lot of people, you are there with them. Greatness is in their presence and they do not see it. I want to remind you to believe in yourself. I want to keep reminding you to know how amazing you are. It doesn't mean that you think you're better than people, no. Or that you're better than anyone, no. That is not what we're saying. It is for these people to know that they are great as well. Blessed by the Almighty, one with God, one with Source, one with the bigger part of who you are, one who comes from God and is part of God, one who is not separate from God. So when people want to make you think you're ordinary, I am here to remind you that you're not I am here, I am here to remind you of your greatness. The multidimensional being that you are, having a human experience. You are more than this physical body. Much more than just this physical body. Hmm? The day is coming. The day is coming when the very person who treated you as if you're nothing, who walked away from you, you are going to hear from them. They will be calling you. They will be messaging you. They will be trying to get your attention. I have seen it. I have seen it in my own life where somebody who acted as if I didn't even matter. The day comes when they are tagging me on social media. They are posting a picture I took with them. 
Hmm? Somebody who rejected me. <laughs> hmm? Now they want my attention. And this happens a lot. I'm sure some of you, you've seen this in your life. All of a sudden, they remember. All of a sudden, they realize they made a big mistake and they want your attention. Especially if you are advancing, if you are rising, if you are moving on up, if you are becoming more and more successful, if things are working out for you, whatever success means to you, you are getting what you want. The light is shining on you. The spotlight is on you. Back then, you were already great, but everything hadn't manifested as yet the way you wanted them to. A lot of you, you will go through this. When you haven't gotten the thing you want, when you haven't manifested your heart's desire or desires like you want to, people will be there treating you with contempt, treating you as if you're nothing not appreciating you, not valuing you, choosing somebody else, not you, estimating another higher than you. It could be a relationship. It could be a potential relationship where they picked somebody else, not you. You are not good enough. You are not pretty enough. You are not handsome enough. You are not smart enough, whatever it may be. Okay, you're smart, you're pretty, you're handsome. But they couldn't see it because of the lens they had on because they didn't have the eyes to see, because of the software that was on their computer, because of the app that was on their phone. They couldn't read it, they couldn't decipher. Greatness was there, they couldn't see it. Then the day comes when they realize, oh my goodness. They realize, oh my goodness, you are a winner. You are doing so much better than them and you are doing so much better than the person they picked you are in a higher position now they want to call you and they are desperate for your friendship they are desperate for your love they are desperate for your attention they want to be in your life they want to be in your life now that you are winning. Will you allow them to come back in your life? Hmm? A lot of people walked away from you. You who were good to them. You who showed them all that love and kindness. They walked away. They thought you wouldn't have won. They thought you were ordinary. They didn't realize how much of an honor and a privilege it was for them to have you in their life. And you're there wondering, what did I do? What did I do wrong? People will walk away from you. They will go their way. You will wonder, what did I do? You will wonder, did somebody say something about me? Did somebody tell a lie about me? That happens as well. Where people are telling lies about you. But if that person was a true friend, they wouldn't have believed it as quickly as they did. A lot of people will break your relationship. They will try to break your relationship, whether it is a romantic or just a friendship by lying about you. Would you believe it? My goodness, they will try to turn everybody against you. You are there wondering what is going on? Why are people turning against me? The lies that have been told about you. I made a video about this. They told lies about you and people believed them. But they will pay for it. Those who lied about you and people believe their lies. It is said that the bigger the lie, the more people will believe it. They told lies about you and people believed 
them and they think they won't pay the price they have a price to pay no debt in the universe goes unpaid they will reap what they sowed those who told lies about you and messed up your relationship but even more than that like we've seen if this person was really a friend they would have asked a question they wouldn't have walked away so they did what they did and now they realize that the person lied to them now they want to come back in your life they say that the best revenge is massive success. That is why you have to keep journeying on. That is why you have to keep putting in the work. That is why you must have this advancing mindset. When you have this advancing mindset, you will end up taking the action that is necessary. You will take inspired action. When you think like a winner, when you think like a successful person, hmm? like an advancing man or woman, the action will follow. So it's important to work on that vibration of yours, to be aligned with whatever it is you want, to be alive, or to, well, to be alive, that's good. I'm happy to be alive, like my song says. <laughs> but to be aligned to what? you want and when you are aligned you will get it you will get what you want the day comes when you get what you want despite them not working with you oh, these people you thought were your friends there they were doing something there they are and they didn't choose you. They didn't bring you along with them. People, they ain't easy. Somebody wrote a song. He said, humans, demons. Humans, demons. They want to see you fall. Hmm? How can people be like that? Somebody who is supposed to be a friend. There they were. Or there they are. They're doing something that you're supposed to be a part of because that is just the way it is you thought they were your friends they did it without you they don't want you on board for so many reasons they're jealous of the fact that you are rising the fact that you are growing they know that if you're there you will shine brighter than them they want to hurt you they want to show you who's really in charge because they are in a secret competition with you and they don't choose you but the day comes when you do well without them let me tell you something you are gonna do well with or without these people you are gonna win without them so the day comes you win without them and they are desperate they want you in the circle again they want to take from you they want what you have to offer they finally see your value they knew on one hand that you were valuable but they were somehow denying it they thought that if they denied it you would have given up they thought that if they didn't choose you you wouldn't have chosen yourself are they crazy hmm? furthermore the most high has already chosen you and you answered the call you choose yourself when people talk about being chosen it's not like god chooses you and you're not part of it no you're not a puppet you have to be you have to answer the call you have to choose yourself hmm? furthermore god is within you you are part of who God is. God is not separate from you. Hmm? So, they are now desperate for your attention. 
they want you in their life they finally see your worth they finally see how amazing you are but i know how amazing you are <laughs> did i say to click that like button smash that like button for the youtube algorithm give the video a thumbs up they want your attention they want your time they want to be part of your circle but only now hmm? too late is their cry you are already working with new people you've already done it without them okay give them that help <laughs> you will decide depending on how you feel but you will not do something that goes against what you're about that goes against who you are I said the day comes when the people who refused you, the people who walked away from you, now they are talking about you like you are so close to them. Hmm? Now they are talking about you as if they had supported you. They didn't support you back then. They didn't show you that love back then. Now they are acting as if they did. Now they are acting as if you are so close to them. There they are messaging you, calling you, talking about you. It's all about you, you, you. They realize what they lost. For many of them, when they lost you, they didn't only lose you, they lost more than you. They lost their blessing you were their blessing you were that person giving to them helping them and they let that go a lot of them they thought the grass was greener on the other side but the green grass turned brown or even more the green grass was fake have you seen this fake grass? You can buy fake grass, it's not grass. But it looks green, they went for that. And it only worked against them. It only led to their demise. Whereas you could have helped them in so many ways. They didn't choose you, they chose somebody else. They didn't realize that you would have reason. You would have been so big, so amazing so great so successful so victorious now they see it it's as clear as daylight and they want you back they want to be in your life mm? they are now desperate when people can walk away from you let them walk that's all right you are gonna win anyway with or without them you are gonna win mm? with or without them it's getting hot in here <laughs> so don't take off all your clothes <laughs> like the song says mm? victory is yours no matter what victory is yours you are gonna continue to advance mm? as i'm here in the audi q5 sending you all of this love all of this light all of this positive energy i look forward to hearing from you i look forward to reading your comments to hearing what you have to say or to reading what you have to say such a joy such a privilege such a great opportunity such a great opportunity to speak with the advancing man or woman that you are the man who can or the woman who can you are valued and you are appreciated my name is Manchus. this is the advancing channel one love God bless. Thank you for watching and all the best.